Do you ever feel like that the only way for you to break past the 20 to 25K a month mark in revenue in your service business is to just work harder, right? To work a little bit later in the day or wake up earlier or to work weekends because you needed to take on that one extra client to, to increase your revenue. I totally get it because here's the reality. As, as a service provider, you know that and probably feel like right now that there's no way for your clients to get results without you being there helping move them through one-on-one, -on -one, dealing with their custom problems, right? Uh, and that's put you in a position where every single time a new opportunity comes your way, even if it's the dream client, that you're a little bit afraid to say yes because you know that by saying yes to that client means more work for you, more work on your plate that you already don't have time for. You're probably already feeling burnt out, maxed out, zero bandwidth, and you know that in order to serve this new client, you're gonna be working weekends or nights, and that's obviously going to eat into your energy and how you show up outside of work and how you show up at home. So it's almost like you self-sabotage yourself by not taking on new business because you know it just means more work for you. But it doesn't have to be that way. Here's the reality is you don't need to offer custom projects and always do custom work one-on-one -on -one in order to get your clients the exact same results, if not better. And you don't have to sacrifice what you charge to do that. So we help our clients become more scalable by simplifying what they do. So with some simple changes to how you deliver your service to your clients, you can more than likely two to three times the number of clients that you can serve in any given month without adding more hours to your day. And you're probably sitting there saying, well, of course, you're probably going to hire help, but I've tried hiring help. It's, it's been difficult. I need to hire experts right? You probably tried to get the help and hiring has been hard. Training new hires to do what you do has been hard because everything you do is custom and everything you do is one-on-one. -on -one. All of that experience, despite how good you are, is still locked up in your head. So what really you need to do to become more scalable as a service provider is to one, package up that experience into a predictable process that helps your client get a specific result. Instead of selling yes, to any request that a potential client has, you need to sell an outcome to a pain or problem that you know your ideal client has, right? And once you sell an outcome, you can create a irresistible, predictable, repeatable, and profitable path to delivering that service without it being one-on-one -on -one and without it being custom. So if you've been trying to escape the one-on-one -on -one custom projects and the scope creep that comes along with the, you know, taking on new clients when you know you don't have the energy or the time or the bandwidth, it is possible to turn it around by making some simple shifts to how you deliver your services. So what I'd like you to do is to join us in our free Facebook group called The Scalable Service Provider, where we constantly share ways for how you can sell your services more like products how you can deliver them like products, and then how you can leverage marketing automation and systems to really start to automate how you sell it and how you deliver, and get this, without adding more hours, without taking away the personal touch, without decreasing your prices, and without adding more hours. If that sounds like something that'd be helpful to you, and you want to finally get out of this resistance of just hustling more and working more hours to take on just one extra client and still not be satisfied with the money that that's bringing in, click the link below, join us in our Facebook group because we're constantly sharing strategies, tips, and tools and resources to help you productize and systematize your service business. And hey, if you have a friend that is running a service business and working clients one-on-one -on -one and they want to get out too, and they want to figure out a way to finally break through this revenue ceiling, click the link below, invite them to the group, and we hope to see you guys in there and we'll talk soon.